and a very good afternoon. This is Business. I'm Charles Aichi. Ahead of the State of the Nation's address by the President this afternoon, my colleague Nicholas Brown visited the Abosokai Square Parts Dealers uh, Association of course, where traders there are calling for the address to deal with the high cost of duties at the port. Here's more. The president is set to present the State of the Nation address today. Um, the coronavirus pandemic is, you know, expected to feature heavily in this year's State of the Nation's address. We are here at the Abuso Okai spare parts uh, market to find out what really is the expectations of the dealers here at Abuso Okai. Well, as what I'm expecting from president is that, or the, the State of the Nation today, that we the dealers in Abuso Okai we're having challenges at the ports, especially when we brought the items from the outside and went to the water. When we go to the ports, we have a lot of challenges. Maybe some even you have a 40 meter container, you have to clear it. Whatever, well, maybe the last year I bought a 40 meter container, if I if were able to pay about uh, 4,000, I'm giving an example about the duty. If I am able to pay 4,000, now I'm paying about six to 8,000, which is double. And then when we bought the items, those who are concerned, they have to buy it from us so that we can go and bring the boost back. We couldn't afford it because the duty is up. So we are trying to tell the president that we should do something about it so that we, those who go outside there and brought the items, they can even when we bought the goods, those who are selling it, they can even buy it from us so that the economy will grow up. And the outcome of our businesses here, because there have been so many promises that has inspired since 2016 about the boosting of Abu Sokain, rates being going down, and then in Harbor, things will be going on well for Abu Sokain. We have not seen anything out of it. And uh, the, the insertion of the COVID has also created a huge problems. And in fact, marketing has become very difficult for us here. So we are expecting the, the president to, I mean, bring in some pragmatic measures that will help boost our businesses, especially uh, our capitals. And I think it will be one of the things that will help us. And we are also expecting the president, whether I don't know, but I think the finance minister should inject some money into the finance so that people can come into the business fraternity and help us. Because because customers do come here, all right, but they don't have what it takes to buy. You tell them the prices and then they turn around and then they go. We also have families to feed. 